Hello beautiful friends and welcome. Today we are going to be talking about all things fall. to share with you guys today i have skincare makeup books mugs road trip snacks all the things let's get into the video i love it um it's kind of messy kind of not so let's get right into it this is currently my favorite fall hairstyle but uh, this is what i use to um get this look i absolutely love it it is a little bit on the pricier side so um, it's a little splurge, but they do go on sale like at Ulta um, around the Christmas time. So do look out for that. It has the curved edges so you can straighten, you can curl, you can do these. I'll insert a video of how I got these. I like this version of the beach waves. It transitions well from summer to fall, but the way that you get it is you literally just go zigzag forward and backwards and it creates this beautiful shape sometimes you have to play around with it but this is the end result and i love it next thing is this cup it is absolutely beautiful i love the amber color and i just really enjoy it i thrifted it for 99 cents and it's just perfect love to elevate my drinks and this is the perfect thing for it let's talk about drinks love this clean brand it is absolutely delicious it has probiotics um, it's really healthy for your gut so if you have issues this is so so good for you the ingredients are really clean it's only 25 calories for one can you cannot go wrong this is orange lemon ginger um this is my favorite raspberry rose and then we have um strawberry lemonade well i actually really like this one too so i don't know um also kombucha absolutely favorite favorite flavor it is so good for you just absolutely delicious and it's gut healthy it has a lot of probiotics um, it's really low in calories it is 70 calories for the whole bottle and that is um, probably like two servings do you see how this just kind of I don't know makes you feel a certain way <laughs> Um, drinking something you know not in the bottle but in a cute cup like this since I'm here I thrifted this adorable candle holder I think it was like a dollar ninety nine or something but it's so freaking cute I am obsessed with the color green and I just like feel like a little house on the prairie carrying it around with me. I don't know, for me it's just like the little things, you know? Now let's move on to makeup. So today my eyeshadow is kind of warm tones. Absolutely love this Morphe palette. Um, it has all the neutrals in there. Uh, most of them are matte besides this one. This is my favorite right now and this one goes in the crease. Um, super cute, super affordable as well. The Naked Palette. Have to have that. Um, I've been loving this one. All the colors are just so pretty. You have the silver, the warm tones, the shimmers. Um, also some nudes that are, that are not shimmery, which is what I kind of gravitate towards. So next we have blush. It's from Tarte and it's this feisty um, color. It is so pretty. It's kind of like peachy, um, but has some depth to it. Absolutely love it. It goes so well with like my more brown tone um, lipstick. Now let's talk about skincare. I have dry skin. 
So I'm constantly trying to find ways to be able to moisturize my skin so my makeup actually looks good and not like it's cracking and flaky. So I've been really liking this turmeric ser serum. So it says um, it's anti-aging, balances even skin, and it has like a fresh aroma. It's not really strong. Um, that's why I like it. This Clinique eye cream is the best. I've been loving it. I just discovered it. It doesn't have like much of a scent. That's what I like about um, Clinique products, but it reduces circles and puffiness. Absolute must if you don't um, get enough sleep or you're just someone that has puffiness under the eyes or discoloration. Here we have Artistry face masks, and I absolutely love them. They are for different things. This one is hydration, my absolute favorite, purifying mask, um, polishing mask, brightening mask, love these. You can use it like two, three times. It lasts a while. This is so good. If you want to have nice feet, but you can't afford to always go to the salon, these little gel socks are everything. They are so good. It comes with like a kit. This is actually a new one I haven't used yet, um, but my other one I had to toss out. These socks are just a game changer. Uh, do your thing, put on those socks, the gel in there, feels so amazing, moisturizes your feet, absolutely worth buying. Now let's talk about hair. So um, my hair is pretty thin. I don't have a lot of it, so I'm always trying to find products that are going to help me with that. Summer is over. I know we all did our fair share of swimming in the pool with chlorine or with um, salt water, which also could be harsh on the on the um, hair so this is Oregon oil my absolute favorite um, I like this one too this one by Paul Mitchell is pretty sweet um, so I like this more for the summertime and then the Oregon oil it has more of like this rich scent I can't explain it it's kind of like creamy and sultry I don't know I just love it it kind of just is like moody like this a lot I just put a little bit on the tips of my finger and just do it on wet hair it works so well this of course the sexy hair big powder play a little bit on the roots goes a long way and it just kind of holds your hair in place if you have thin hair or if you want volume you need to get that product nail polish this one is my current favorite. It's not too dark and moody, but it's not like summertime. I think this is like the perfect middle ground. In between, I always make sure to put a strengthening coat just to keep my nails nice and healthy. We all know we don't have time to wash that hair all the time. This is my absolute favorite dry shampoo. I'm a hairstylist and I love this one so much because it actually works. A lot of these um, dry shampoos just don't do its job. And this one, you can, you can depend on this one for sure. Now let's talk about jewelry. I am in dire need of new jewelry, but currently these are my favorite earrings. I am loving this, I'm always wearing it, but recently I have bought some more chunkier pieces. And this is one of them. This is more of a statement piece, so cute. Let me know below if you are a gold jewelry gal or do you go for silver? Let me tell you, this has been on repeat in my family since October hit, but we don't just eat the soup like this. We elevate it like nobody's business, and I'm gonna show you how I do that. I add dumplings, I add shrimp, all the toppings, you know it. I make this so good, and it's pretty healthy for you. This is actually rice noodles. 
had no idea my sister pointed that out um would have eaten it anyways <laughs> but these are so good and they're hard to find too if you're gonna eat pho you have to do it the right way homemade dumpling runny eggs chives cilantro and you can't forget the lime let's talk about favorite mugs how stinking adorable is this it is so cute it comes in a set of four i got it at walmart and it's just adorable i love it i make my coffee in it my second one is big enough to be a cereal bowl or a soup bowl look at this it is massive we got this on our san francisco trip last time and it is so cute i love the inside the heart let's talk about books this is what i am currently reading the compound effect it is absolutely like a must you have to read this the compound effect of um, our daily habits the things that we do uh, it is so good this is my second time reading it and every time I read it it's like something new pops up or pops out at me I am currently reading I survive books with my kids and this series is so good it is real stories that they add fictional characters to and it's only $1.49 from Goodwill. Anytime we are there, we just stop by, browse through, see if there's anything that we don't have, and we just pick it up. It is usually $5.99, $5.99, so definitely a better deal to get it at Goodwill. Um, we just finished the Wellington Avalanche 1910, and then we are starting. The eruption of Mount St. Helens, 1980. So love that my kids can learn some history while, um, you know, still being entertained. Now, talk about road trip snacks. Beef jerky, this brand right here, the Old Trapper is my favorite. This one is so good. It is not comparable to any other brand. Like absolutely love this. Pop it in the freezer. So when you take it on your road trip and it is just cold and so delicious. So just to get the conversation going uh, at the dinner table or even breakfast, I thrifted this conversation starter. It is so good. It has all the different things. Uh, like let me see how often do you let the little stuff get in the way of the big stuff and we just kind of go around and whoever wants to say something says it if you don't want to say anything we just kind of go to the next one um, what are you afraid of at 3 a.m. so some of them are more serious some of them are not it's just a good way to get conversation going you know and that kind of helps the kids start talking and then they start talking about their day and it just really leads to like good quality time with your family or friends whatever it is um here we have my favorite teas so currently i have been loving the english breakfast and the cinnamon stick and they're both black teas i find myself gravitating more towards black tea because i feel like green tea is a little bit too bitter for my liking so i've been loving this you know in the morning instead of coffee or sometimes after my coffee i decided not to buy too many candles this season and just got this really massive beautiful candle i love this color it's just so pretty looks pretty on my coffee table but it smells very um like not very but kind of manly it has like a musky scent it is so good i absolutely love it i'm not really i love to eat pumpkin flavors but i'm not a big fan of the scent so i ended up wanting to just not incorporate it into any of the candles or the scent that I bought like um, my humidifier as well oh humidifier let me we 
love these two essential oils. This one is orange and this one is apple and these are my absolute favorite. It just kind of freshens up the house and makes it smell fresh and yummy. Can you guys please comment below what shows are you watching this fall season because I seem to not be able to get into watching Gilmore Girls. I know everyone is watching it but for me it seems like the show is just like so slow or something I don't even know but it's it's I could watch it with my kids but not not for me um, what I currently started watching with my teenage daughters is One Tree Hill and I'm absolutely loving it it is so good this is my go-to lipstick this year it is lipstick O2 sorry don't really know but I got it I have a subscription with Epsi, I believe it's called. And this is like my perfect shade. It's not too dark, not too, uh, not too summery. Love this one. Then let's talk about perfume. Okay, this is my, like, I don't know how many times I said absolute favorite, but when I say favorite, this is favorite love this perfume so much mm, it's like mature but not too mature it okay so base notes are cedar wood blonde wood and musk middle note is daffodil milky accord and the top notes are rhubarb orange blossom and peach so so good now let me end off with one of my old-time favorite things i have been using so much this past few weeks because just you know cozy vibe it's starting to get dark much sooner it is this tray it's like a bedside tray it has these legs i use it when we're snacking on the couch watching tv I use it when I'm in bed. It's just something I am constantly using. Before you go, please comment what are some of the things you love to do during the fall season? Maybe it's places to go or certain movies you like to watch, maybe things you love to eat. I would love to hear all of the things because I'm always looking for new fun things to do or to try. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. It really does help out my channel. All the little moments add up to the bigger picture. And don't forget to live beautifully today. Cheers.